Prudential East Africa Assurance became fully owned by Kenya in 1991 and changed the name to First Assurance. That's how First Assurance was born. Then recently, in 2005, the Barclays Africa acquired 63% share of First Assurance and now First Assurance is fully owned by Barclays Africa. First Assurance is actually an insurance company which does composite insurance. We do both general business, life and medical health. General insurance, we do all lines of business, including motor, personal accident, all those aviation and the rest. We also do group life, credit mortgage, and also the health insurance, which we cover for both individual and corporate. We ensure that the members who we get our insurance, get adequate and proper health care to the facilities which are available within and outside the country. Most of healthcare service providers, even in the remote areas, are connected with biometric systems so that any of our clients who goes to any of these service providers, irrespective of where they are, make sure that they are able to use the fast assurance card to get the services. So when members go to the hospitals, what they need to do is just present our health card to the providers. All the details, benefits which we have given you and all the limits are loaded on the card and when you go there they just check if that limit is covered they will go ahead and give you the service you want. The MPLS actually allow us the branch connectivity. We Currently we have uh, five branches locally and one in Tanzania which are all connected through a single MPLS. Now we are able to connect our branches without through the VoIP which is much more cheaper. Whenever there is a problem through MPLS services, the resolution service is very, very fast. It is managed 24-7. So wherever there is a problem in terms of issues, you find that internet solutions are very fast to detect and resolve the issues. So without this kind of system, actually you are at a ground zero. You cannot give any service without the technology that we stand currently. The major challenges we face in actually in medical provisions is the cost of services. So one of the things we have done really to remediate this is to have a discussion with the service providers to negotiate some of those services and also to come up with the sub co pays so that if you are using the card then the client also can have some bit to pay, increase the deductibles and also to exclude some of the non-health expenses like if you go to the hospital if you are given a basin or a sandal or a face towel, then we exclude it as part of the payment. Connectivity in some of the remote places, especially the NGOs, who are in very some remote places. So we are forced to incur some additional cost actually to have our third party provider to issue the biometric systems for them to use our cards. Kenya is one of the African countries which have e health uh, strategy. We will be seeing the e-health facility where we'll have the integrated system for e-journals where people can go and get quite a number of information through the. We have also mobile technology, mobile health, where we use mobile to actually offer medical statistics, data, and services. For fast assurance, technology in healthcare means efficiency and quality. <laughs>